Yeah. Okay, today we're at the Chipping Green and um, we're going to try and um, have a look at whether Cassie needs to get heavier club heads for her short irons. She's got a very lightweight set of irons. Um, a couple of weeks ago she did a couple of chips with my pitching wedge now, not to in straight away. I was like, wow, your, your club heads are so much heavier. So we're gonna do a little survey today. We're gonna to chip with the pitching wedge out to the hole there where my cap is um, and see if she feels actually better with a heavier club head. We would have to get the uh, shafts lighter, but she's gonna use mine compared to hers. With my clubs, there's a lot of weight in the head. So the, the head actually does a lot of the work for you. With Cassie's, there's not so much weight in the head. Um, so I just sort of like swing back and just let the club drop and then it throws the ball out there. With Cassie's um, wedge, if I do the same thing and let it drop, as it's a lot lighter, you feel like you've got to hit it a bit more. And Cassie has the tendency to try to hit her club rather than let it just sweep through. Um, so we're going to see, Cassie's going to take six pitching wedges with my one, six pitching wedges with her one. Let's get into it. Letting the, the weight of the club drop down as you turn. Okay, pretty good. Need to probably aim it a little bit further right. Skinny, that's death. Back and then just let it drop as you go through. Great shot. Yeah, nice shot. That. That's it. There's no swaying on the back swing. Yep, good. That's the shot. Yeah, nice shot. Good. That's really good. Okay, let's go and have a look at these ones. We had the one that was an absolute disaster, but the actual results are consistent. So you can get these closer. Oh, that's going to be very good. Oh, a little bit over there. Last shot was... Uh... Oh, that's really good. Yeah, it's in the hole. It's in the hole! Oh my, my cap is by the hole. That was in the hole. Not, not much. That's three, four feet. That's no, good. That will be too much. Yeah, a little bit too... Yeah, very good. Not a bad shot at all. Oh, got unlucky there. All right, now, I mean, two tap-ins and a hole out, and that one would have been um, pretty close had she not hit the first ball. And two slightly, okay, pitching wedge, my pitching wedge. Where's your land spot? Just like right in front of where the second bump is. Okay, where the second bump is, okay. It's good. It's a good shot. Very important to know where you want the ball to land. That's going to be perfect. Oh, soft landing, but good ball. Okay, your balls. Your, sorry, your pitching wedge now. So Cassie's pitching wedge. Yeah, it's going to be decent. A little bit to the right. Okay, well, it's always difficult to do an evaluation on just so few data, but Cassie's actually played my pitching wedge better than hers, but not much in it. I think with a bit of practice with hers, she'll get them down to the same sort of distance. The sandwich now. This is Sassy's sandwich. She got that on the down slope. That's worked out really well. That's going to be good too. Yeah, those are three very good sandwiches with yours. Let's have a look at, see how you do with mine. I'm playing the, the Vocky 56. 56 is sandwich. It's a lot heavier, yeah? Oh yeah. You swing through. Well, that's uh, done pretty well. First time ever with that club. Not bad.
Wow. The question really is, if I get a heavier P, would I be able to swing the actual swing? That is a good question. That would give you more distance as well. So Do you want to try the driving range for a session? Yeah, but then I'm scared it's going to mess up my swing. That's I think you're okay now. Your swing is, uh, you know what you're doing with your swing now. But I, I don't think, think it'll make much difference. In terms of sand wedge, I think my one, I've got... Yeah, no, because you've been praying more, but uh, your sand wedge, definitely, those three balls closest to yours. Not much in it though. You've got them by about one foot each. So as you guys could see there, my sand wedge was easier for me personally to hit than this one. I felt that that was very heavy. Um, but the pitching wedge, uh, Coach Dad's pitching wedge and mine don't have much in it. So yeah, I just think I need to practice mine more. So thanks for watching this video guys. We hope you enjoyed it. Click the thumbs up button if you like this video and subscribe. Bye.